Hey, what's up, you guys? Denny with ET Online. I'm hanging out with these guys, Barrett Fo and Renee Felice Smith of NCIS Los Angeles. Good morning, you guys. Hey. Oh, so we had LL and Chris O'Donnell here last time, so I'm excited to get some love from you guys too because there's a lot going on with your characters. What can you tell us about tonight's episode? Well, Nell is having to deal with um, kind of a traumatic incident that happened. Uh, she had to shoot someone for the very first time. So Nate Getz, our psychologist, is coming back to assess her to see if she is sound enough to return to the workplace or it, even if she wants to return to the workplace. I think she's oh, not. Yeah, there's like a little bit of doubt in there, isn't Yeah, there? she's not so sure if this is kind of the right path for her. Look, I just think if I found myself in a similar situation, I wouldn't choose to feel this way again. If there's even an ounce of truth to that, you shouldn't go back to the field. Because it's not just your own life you're protecting out there. I think what's kind of great about our show is that we're not all superheroes. That, you know, there's like, there's a real human aspect. It's nice that we check in with her and we, we talk about the ramifications of something as serious as having to defend yourself and shoot someone. Barrett, what can you tell us what we can expect from your character in the next couple episodes? Oh, some really kind of Scary stuff. I mean, this one's going through some scary stuff, and as as, as am I. Um, there's needles of poison. There's two poisonous guns. Plants. There's poisonous plants. There's um, basically the whole the whole place gets uh, gets <laughs> locked down, and everyone is stuck inside. Yeah. Um, and we've never really done that. Never really. We've never done that before. Right. It's it's really intense. So like, there is a mole among us, and we have to figure out who it is. And there Eric is, is kind of tasked with a lot of that because he spends all of his time on the inside, and then he's a key suspect. Yeah, and then uh, yeah, I turned. Yeah, oh my god. You heard it here first, folks. I heard it here first. <laughs> on the it's, edge of my seat. It's, yes. it's, it is. It's actually. It's a really great episode. It, and we actually a... have a little quarrel coming up in the episode where Mr. Beale raises his voice to one Ms. Nell, and she's not having that. She's not having she's that. She's not having that. that. Place. He's a little stressed. That. Nobody puts his baby in the corner. <laughs> I saw on Instagram, you guys um, threw a flash mob or something? Uh, we choreographed a flash mob for the casting crew for our rap party. And it was a surprise for mm, a lot of people there. And uh, it went over surprisingly well. <laughs> your go-to dance move. I'll do it right now. Oh, of course. Yeah, oh, right. I do the cabbage patch. The okay. cabbage patch. It's okay. a go-to. Okay. What else you got? Kids on the block, a little ring. Oh, what? Don't leave. Let's hang out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Anyways, we, but Monday nights, new time, right? 10 o'clock, yeah. the new sexy NCIS Los Angeles, right? Well, we can't wait, you guys. Thanks so much for coming by. Yeah, thanks for having us.